Welcome to Community Connections, a program brought to you from Muskegon Rescue Mission. And for many of you who watch us, you're going to know who I am, but for those of you who don't, I'm Carla Skoglund, and joining me today is Phyllis Williams. Phyllis and I are a, con are a frequent duo on this program, aren't we? <laughs> yes, but we are. What we want to do is bring you information about what we're doing at the Rescue Mission, knowing that as we connect with the community we live in, and we, as we share with you some of the things we do, you may be interested in that. You may say, you might even decide, gee, I'd, I'd like to know more about that. You might even say, could I join one of the things that they're doing, even though I live in the community? Or you might know somebody that you say, boy, I wish they could go and, and have benefit of those programs, and that could happen too. So we want you to know more about us so that it can benefit you as well as the people who come and live with us. So today, the last time we did the program, mm -hmm. Phyllis and I talked about uh, some back to school issues and mm -hmm. all the kids are back in school now. I know, this it, month's just flown by. It has, I just, I'm amazed, it's so quiet around here right now, mm. other than with the little preschoolers. Yeah. It's just quiet in the building because we have women here but all the kids are in school it'll get lively about four o'clock though yes it will <laughs> yes it will when the kids come back and that's good they get an afternoon snack and then you know they have to kind of relax and, and talk to moms and, and figure out what they're doing and talk about what they did do and eventually it gets to homework time for it the does. kids and the homework room actually we're up on the third floor of the women's building right now and we're in the living room of our discipleship program but we also have a great after school room and we have areas where the kids can play and we have a preschool room and all these good things so uh, eventually the kids will get to doing their homework again in the yes. after school room but for right now uh, they're in school but what we want to share with you are some of the things that we're doing with the women we have a couple new programs that we were sharing mm -hmm. the last time yeah. and we're talking about uh, the life skills program now life skills let's go back we're just going to recap a little bit and then we're going to move forward but the life skills program as you were sharing with me is mm -hmm. is for the women in the shelter and for the women on our discipleship program yes and for those of you who don't if perhaps you've not heard this we have two different programs one of is the shelter women and that they're here up to three months hopefully we've helped them find a place to stay in three months and they're reestablished, or they can go on our long-term program our discipleship program and that's a year to 15 months yes. it's self-paced so it just depends how quickly the women can move through but the life skills well, we've changed some things around and i love the mm -hmm. fact that the women are so enjoying this they are they it, really are we actually i know had to postpone one of our classes and they're all what happened to class and when are we having it again and i you love know, it. they really are enjoying it well you know i was i was here two days ago and and uh, I was walking through downstairs, and I mean the the dining room is full. Mm -hmm. The women are all at mm -hmm. tables, and and I love it. They're studying, but they're talking, and mm -hmm. they're they're discussing what they're going through, and they're learning. And I can tell, you know, a few of them had a cup of coffee, yep. which is fine. You know, I yeah. so if I was there, I'd probably want a little cup mm -hmm. of coffee then. Yeah, absolutely. But I love the fact that they were enjoying learning and having a class discussion about what they were they were being taught that day mm -hmm. and so that was part of the life skills class yes it's it's really we provide the curriculum we provide um the topics based on what they kind of are they help select the as topics, well as, don't they? You know, yeah. yeah, and what mm -hmm. what our demographics and what our statistics tell us you know we kind right. of follow that as well yes. but they're learning not only from our curriculum and the materials that are there but from each other I know. um it, it's applying it to their life it's exactly. not just you know they have so much experience and knowledge whether it's street knowledge or book knowledge or other knowledge that's right it's, and and learning and seeing the light bulbs go off is fun exactly i mean it's really and, and they're learning that piece too that going to school doesn't have to be horrible horrible no it can be fun. And I like the fact, too, even though it's life skills, and we all learn life skills in life, mm -hmm. good and bad good life and skills, bad. Mm -hmm. you know, but, but they're part of, of, of who we are and part of, of, of what has happened to us in life. Mm -hmm. And for the women, for some of the things that they have learned, some of life that they mm -hmm. have lived has been difficult Very. and has been negative. And so what we can do is help turn that around mm -hmm. and, and help them to see that there's hope, there's a great future, because God says he gives us hope mm -hmm. and a future. And it's in him. But as we help them to learn how to turn that around mm -hmm. and drop the negative ones and learn more about the good ones and learn some new mm -hmm. one new that are good, mm -hmm. it helps it helps to make them more able to manage life. Mm 
Mm-hmm. So let's go back a minute. I want to talk about the life skill yeah. classes because I was so excited. Yeah. That's what I learned. So tell us a little bit about those. Well, the life skill classes are held um, three days a week, Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. Okay. Um, right now we're in a, a, a individual classes. We have conflict resolution on one day. We have money management on another. And then we have... Um, um, another class on Thursday. Okay. Um, in the past we had, because the lessons were so many, we had just one topic. We did decision making for five weeks, sure. three days a week. Um, and decision it, making is a big topic. It's a big topic. And, and as the conversation goes, you don't want to necessarily rush through things either. Right. I mean, there's value in, in the stories and in the lessons and the, and, and the um, shared information that goes exactly. on. Um, and you don't want to rush that. You don't want right. to move before everybody's ready to do that. So good point. Um, I, I'm, so, and I'm really, and we don't have to rush. We it. don't have to. You know, that's, we can that's take the time. Thing. That's Absolutely. exactly right.